Oh. So these are these are not for me because these are actually these were used in the production. These are the actual masks here. Because each of you all just want to use the So what is it about the mask? What is it? Why do these work? And tell me about. Obviously, these are very familiar to folks that remember the 2008. Yeah, there's my Halloween costume right there. Um, Talk to me about sort of why these masks work. What's it like to see an actor in these masks on set? What strikes you? Well, the, the masks were a real challenge. There is no secret vault in Hollywood where you can just go and like, I'd like to get those strangers masks. We had to make them from scratch and it was a really hard task to figure out how to make them and uh, what they should look like and, and how our principle was like everything with these movies, is they have to feel real. Uh, these are not like the bat suit that should just develop from movie to movie and, and, and be somehow uh, updated. We want it to be uh, quite uh, faithful to the, the originals. And uh, it took months to, to create them. And a lot of people tried and failed. We test shot them, we lit them and shot them and tried to, to get them just right to work in every lighting condition and so on. And, um, and the, the masks were not finished until the morning the shooting started. And we had only one of each. So we were, they were like, you know, it was like having some diamonds, like, you know, one of those security guards shows up and then opens the box and there's the thing. Uh, and, uh, you know, if, if any of them broke or something happened, we would have been so, so screwed. So, um, does the atmosphere change on set when an actor puts on that mask? Does the temperature drop a little bit? So it's a absolutely, and these were tailor-made for the actors so that they fit their faces perfectly. Well, I mean, we were like in the woods of uh, Slovakia through like endless, endless, endless nights, and literally like you'd you know, be trying to find your way to set through these woods, and one of the actors would be like standing on the side and wearing their mask, <laughs> <laughs> and literally you'd stop. <laughs> yeah, and I, what I think about is, it, 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 you know, what, what's so special about these masks is that they, you know, obviously they are very iconic, and and that they they kind of have this almost like a fun expression, like almost like a smile, yet they seem so cold and and impenetrable. So it, it, when when the, when the act, actors who play the strangers when they show up with these on, on, on in, in the scenes, there's just it's just something something so creepy and weird. It's like one thing if this mask was really scary, okay, that's a scary character, but it's almost friendly in a certain way. Yeah, there's a yet there's a person behind it who is obviously absolutely cold-hearted and randomly sadistic. So this is like Rene and I, you know, so he's like, they're friendly in a way. I'm like, if I saw one of these people walking up to me wearing this mask, I'm high you the other way. <laughs> <laughs> they're friendly. So, I'll put these back in the but, 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 you know, here's the thing. On the design, you know, they gave us a whole bunch of options of how to sort of update them. You know, and we kept looking at them, and we kept looking at each other, and we kept going, this is just not right. And we did this many times as far as the original Strangers was concerned. You know, where they did it right, we agreed with it. Um, and so with the masks, where we ended up was there's very slight differences from these masks to the original ones used in the original Strangers because really they were so chilling in the first place. We thought they were so effective, it was better to stick with them. Um, and so there's very few alterations. As Renner was saying, we sort of said this is not a Batman movie. We have to update the suit. We have to do that. Um, we like what was done, made very small modifications. And also the way they fit on the actors' faces made them a little bit more chilling as well, especially in the case of Scarecrow. Um, I, I literally can't see anything in the audience, but there should be a, a mic in each uh, aisle here. So if you guys want to line up, if you're not already, we can take your questions in just a second. So we've been, we've been talking a little bit. Yes, there we go. Uh, in a second, we're going to come to you guys. Don't you worry.